good morning, okay? This is the single mom versus the fixer-upper. And I have to start seeing this in the beginning. I am starting over in my 40s. I literally had a 18-year marriage, literally, okay? Starting over by myself as a single mom, purchased a home in a state where I have no family and I know anyone. This home looked like, <laughs> to be funny, I'll say a trap house. Like most people didn't even want to walk inside this door, okay? Sometimes we have things that we want and things that we want to do, but at the end of the day, things are a process. Like I never knew that I'll be laying on a air mattress for 14 months. Y'all slept on this air mattress for 14 months. Now it was the several different ones because a couple of them popped and, you know, it was deflating, and deflating in the middle of the night and leaving me on the floor. But it's been 14 months of me sleeping on that thing. I finally moved my furniture in. I have been paying over $300 for storage fees for over a year. Okay, I just got my stuff out of storage a couple weeks ago. Thank God that is a blessing. So that's money I'm saving. I just last night was doing my budget. I was doing my budget for um, October. Um, and yeah, it's just like a blessing. I'm grateful. Even though the house still isn't where I want it to be, I'm seeing everything be implemented. If you are wanting to see my journey, the ins and outs, the ups and downs, what I'm feeling, what I'm going through while transitioning this home that nobody wanted, not even my realtor wanted to walk in the door. If you want to see that, see who I am, genuinely, genuinely me, been this way forever and see this journey of me transforming myself, my mental, my spiritual, and also my home and being a parent and a homemaker at the same time. Today, you're going to watch me get rid of this air mattress. It's actually laundry day as well, so I'm going to be doing a lot, but it's going to be a different video to laundry day. Um, I love to clean. I love to organize and make things functional. So I'm going to be putting out a lot of videos of me doing the things that I love to do instead of creating videos or trying to do things that I'm not ready to do now just to get the house where it needs to be. I'm ready to get in my bed. So yes, we want to take that bed out the living room and you get ready to see where it is. We're going to build the frame first. I, since it's laundry day, I'm going to take the little protector off of it. Once I get it on the frame, wash that and then go wash all my other stuff for the day. So I'm going to be doing like two videos, two videos at the same time. So I hope you enjoy. Share the channel. If you have any questions, you know what to do. Talk to me in the comments because I definitely talk back. If you're new to the channel, I thank you. I thank you. I thank you. I see that most of my new subscribers are the ones. I mean, the new people that are coming are the ones that are watching more of my videos. So I thank you guys so much for joining me. Trust me, you're going to like it here because I talk about how to budget, how to stay within your budget and live below your means. OK, and not try to follow trends or be influenced by things that are not within your means so yeah if that's what you like let's get into this video sorry for this being so long but i definitely have to put out there my situation because i want other people to know that you can do it too don't be fearful you got this and i'll try to link the video of my thoughts and my process of when i bought the house and what people were saying and how i felt so let's get into getting my mattress and i mean my bed in here and get the frame done so my daughter's gonna help me so we about to get this bad boy Inflated, deflated, deflated. Let's get the bed in. Hey, my Gator. So this right here is so satisfying to me because to know that I laid on this thing for 14 months, I didn't expect that. That was not something that I thought was going to happen. Um, I am grateful that I did have an air mattress to lay on. People have had stories where they had to lay on the floor or had to lay outside. Um, so I'm not going to take away from me being grateful to be able to even have a mattress to lay on. But the fact that in my brain and my plan that I had set out, I definitely wasn't planning on even laying on it an eighth of the time <laughs> that I did. Um, but God's plan and my plan isn't the same. So it's so satisfying to me. I'll just have this for company for the holidays, but it's so satisfying to me to see this being put away and being able to bring my bed out. So tonight will be the first night of a great sleep on my mattress that I'm so grateful for and thankful for as well. I hope you guys are enjoying this vid. Uh, I am to be able to make up my bed. Um, I don't know where my actual bedding is and all the other stuff is, but this is just a quick bedroom, you know, refresh and to get rid of the air mattress. Okay, Enjoy. Already. So I wanted to share with you guys, this is where my bed is, it is a king. And this is why I want to lay it down because I got to take this off. It already has a protector on it, a zip protector, but still I always put extra protection on it. So 
once we lay it down and get it on the frame i'll be pulling this off it's hard to pull it off while it's up against this wall this thing is ridiculously heavy but it'll also free up some room inside the um living room to stack boxes over here instead of having them all on this side so just wanted to come in and say that continue watching us we about to put it together all right so let's talk about this frame this frame is over a little over five years old and i love it i have a king bed and um that bad boy is thick and it's big and i literally have not had any problems i've moved with it twice and it's still sturdy it's still holding together this one is an 18 inch i love it because the actual depth underneath the bed the um empty space under the bed gives you space to put totes and stuff so i use the bottom of my bed as another part of my closet and you guys will see videos of that because i am doing decluttering videos as we speak as well and you're going to see how i organize my space to make it more functional decluttered and here we go taking this big boy in the room it was a struggle but we did get it in so continue enjoying the video <laughs> later y'all yeah it was a struggle um my ceilings are not high so the bed looks really huge but i do i do have space i know y'all seen other people with king size beds and they don't have no space the room is nice size like i still have a lot of space so um this headboard just seems to be bigger than my bed so i'm thinking maybe it was for california because i have a regular king because it's so much wider and i don't know if i'm gonna keep it i think i'm gonna sell the headboard um, I'm going to sleep with it for a little bit, but I think I'm going to sell the headboard because I want to eliminate as much space as possible and I want my bed to be close to my nightstand. Like, I don't want that. I don't want that space. That way I can push. Actually, I don't know. I, I don't know. We'll figure it out, guys. We'll figure it out. But I have to move on to doing laundry because um, my... Uh, Thing that I just took off needs to be washed. So I'm going to do this on a super quick wash so I can put this on first and have that ready um, for when I get ready to lay down. So yeah, that was that. You guys will see the other part. So just stay tuned. Editing, you know, it'll be a couple seconds for you, but it'll be about, about an hour for me. <laughs> I hope you guys are enjoying the video and I'll see you in the next part. What we just did, um, I was really annoyed by the bed, but now that I was able to lift it up, I lifted it up on, let me show y'all, the frame. And I shouldn't have to bracket it to the bed because there's a frame and I was able to set that on top of the frame. So that might work. I just still feel like, let me see something. Let me maybe push it over a little bit on this side. Why is it doing this? My phone is acting stupid, y'all. It is not trying to let me be great. Okay. All right. So let's see. That's I wanted my headboard high. I didn't want my headboard low, and I have space, so it it looks okay. I wanted it to look grand because the room ceilings aren't that big, but I wanted to give that illusion. So I like, I like, I like, I like it. All right. I'm going to have to stop this recording because it's saying I'm out of space. While I'm recording, it won't let me pause. This is crazy. All right, y'all. so we can ready to make this bed up with some of the stuff i was able to pull out of storage that's what i've been sleeping on on my ear mattress i don't know where all my regular bedding is i have some old old pillows i need to replace <laughs> do not buy what pillows are these they got protectors on them but these are the ones that i put my black satin things on and it feel like they turn the color of them so yeah all my pillows have protectors but they're old and need to be replaced but for right now we still going to use them so we're gonna get these pillow protectors on 
I'm gonna put the skirt on the bed and I'm also gonna put that um, protector over it first before I put the sheet and the pillowcases on. So let me put the top part on first, this, and, um, and then you'll just see what else. It'll be sped up, but enjoy. I'll be back in the next clip. So guys, as I'm doing this, I realize I'm going to need Naya because this bed skirt, the way that it's easier to put on is for two people to stretch it over it and it'll just stay put. So yeah, I'm going to need Naya. So that'll be the next clip. I tell y'all I am hot. Mm, I'm doing a laundry video. I probably got to do a two part to that because I'm ready to take this off, get ready to have dinner. We all hungry. And um, yeah. I still got maybe I'll probably do one more load, but the rest I'm gonna keep for tomorrow. Probably won't even do one more. I'll probably just keep the rest for tomorrow because I am hot. So my baby about to help me put this on, and y'all about to watch us put it on. Okay. Alright, so I love this um sheet, I mean skirt, because you don't have to lift the bed up and do all that crazy stuff. Let me push this over a little bit. You just slide it around the frame of your bed. And then once you put your bedding on, you won't even see that. So I love, love, love that sheet. And it also, I mean this um skirt, and it protects um, you know, from seeing what's underneath your bed. So I love it. And I think, yeah, I got this from either Walmart or Amazon. If you're interested, it's old. It's not no. That's been on my bed since I lived in New York. So over three years ago. And so um, definitely, no, not over three, over two years ago. <laughs> um, so definitely, um, if you're interested, then I'll look for it. But if not, I ain't gonna waste my time. But I love it because you don't got to lift the bed up. It don't got to go underneath something. It'll stay there and it don't shift with the bed because it's on the frame. So I love it. I love it. So that's my bed. I'm just going to be putting my covers on top of me. I'm not doing anything fancy. The covers that I put in the wash is what I'm putting on top of me. And um, I'll be going through my boxes slowly but surely and finding out. These are my socks. They need to be washed. I'm um, finding out where my bedding is. I got to get my new pillows. I got a lot of stuff to do, but I'm just grateful to be able to sleep in my regular bed. No more air mattress. So, yeah. If you enjoyed the video, make sure that you like it, share it. And if you're new to the family and you've already became a part of family by subscribing, I thank you, I thank you, I thank you. If you haven't, check out the channel. See how you like it. If you enjoy it, please join the family by hitting the subscribe button. Hit the notification bell so you're notified every time I load a new video. Now that I can start editing, I'm going to try to find a... Uh, days like scheduled like I might put videos out on Saturday or Sunday and then one day a week or something like that two different videos but good edited videos I hate that I have to just throw them up can't put no music can't voice over can't because sometimes when you forget something it's good to be able to voice over or edit it and excuse me you can't do that when you're just taking it straight from your phone and putting it on YouTube so I'm excited about the editor learning the editor and all that so just stay tuned for better video better quad quality videos and more in-depth videos so I will see you guys later, Gators. And guess what? Talk to me in the comments because I will talk back. See y'all in the next video. Say it's been a long day. I had to stick this in here. I'm like, how do I share with them that I'm literally getting it? I don't know if it's going to be stuck in here or a separate video, but uh, it's made. And this will be the first night that I lay in my bed. The space in here is amazing. I need y'all to see this. I got to cut this light on. Like, <laughs> it is so spacious in here like i could put a whole chair here a lamp or whatever it is very spacious like i'm so happy i'm thankful i'm grateful yeah and this will be the first night that i lay in my bed 
We getting in right now. Man, it's 7.50. I'm usually a night owl. Oh my gosh, I missed this. Oh my gosh, I missed this. That plastic will be coming off soon. Um, once I find something to like put over it, night was gonna make me something that can roll down. I always keep something on my head, but I hate when people have dingy headboards that are cloth. That's why I was leery about getting a cloth one. But whew, we shall see. Oh my gosh. Oh, this is so much different from oh, this is so much different from an air mattress. Oh my gosh, thank you, God. Thank you, God. Oh Whew. when I tell y'all I'm tired. I am tired. I gotta cut this fan on because I'm hot. I got up on the thing because when it sit down on the floor, it hardly can touch me because the bed is so high. But yeah, and I do like my exclusive curtain, even though I got blinds because it's still daylight outside. Let me show y'all because it darkens the room um, until I get my room darkening um, curtains in here. It's still, it's not, uh, it's like daylight, but not too, too bright. Let me show you. Oh, it's dark. It's dark. It's dark. Which light? It's dark. <laughs> but, yeah. All right, y'all. <sighs> Let me get back in the bed. I don't even know if I want to wear this. Like, I don't even want nothing on. I feel hot. <sighs> but, I'm laying in my bed. Thank God. I'm about to find a movie on my projector. And, um, yeah. Let's see it came on. <laughs> and relax. Talk to you guys in the next video. Later, y'all.